Okay, so this is a tiny little scroll mm. that you can digest quite quickly. Um, very, very impactful though. Yep. Again, this is another <laughs> one of those, those scrolls that came out in the 90s um, during the time we, we were referred to as going through the Right Knowledge mm. series. Again, this is authored in 1994 by Dr. Malachi yep. Z. York. Um, and we were known as the Holy Tabernacle Ministries during that time as well. And this is a very interesting question. Does God help his own? Because what it is, the religious world that claim, claim God, Allah, in fact, what I'm going to do. Um, so that question is like, does God help his own? And in this book, it asks, so are you saying that God doesn't help his own, mm. right? And he says, let's just take a look at these people who are Jews, Christians, Mohammedans, Buddhists, Hindus, who all will freely say, thanks to Yahweh, Jehovah, Adonai, Hashem, Theos, Christ, God, Allah, Rabbi, Om, Krishna, Shiva, Brahma, and a host of Egyptian deities by whatever names, you call them such and such survived in an earthquake can't you see that this is a personal emotion you're not considering all the other people who died in the earthquake not to mention the animals and the vegetation that lived are also cut off but that's not important to you because your god teaches you that he's only concerned with people of your religious persuasions and in this case, your family members only. I can't see a God who has preference like that. Now, let's take a closer look at the world and what happens in it. And it's supposed to be controlled by God. Who's ever God is responsible? So the question is, who, this is another scroll called Whose God is Responsible? Um, but the question, does God help his own? It's like people are only concerned when things affect them personally like if somebody else has an accident or they die of cancer or whatever's going on mm. it's like mm, they only get concerned when it's personal yeah. so the question is when two people are in a car accident for example and one crosses over or dies unfortunately and one survives People will say, oh, thank God for the person mm. that survived, especially if, if it's their family member. So the question is, who is responsible for the person who died? Mm. And when the person that survived, let's say, has a broken leg or whatever, and they go to hospital, the doctors are the ones that do the work yep. to mend them. And then people will say, oh, thank God. But it was the doctor that did it. So this scroll goes into asking a lot of questions about situations where people claim is God. I'm going to tell you something as well that might surprise you. There's nowhere in the scriptures that says God knows everything. Mm. But people will say he knows everything. To know something is after it has happened. You see, so... Yeah. This question is a very profound question because you can pray all day long for something and if you claim that God is listening to you, why doesn't he help you? And people will say, he does help, but he helps in his own time. Mm. But you want the help in your time, yep. right there and then. So it's all right to wait a year or six months or whatever and then you do it yourself mm. or someone else does it and you claim that it was God that did it. So the question is, if God can do it instantly and do it right away because he has the ability, why doesn't he? Does he help mm. his own? Yeah. Who is his own? <laughs> yeah. Because everyone <laughs> claims God for themselves. Yeah, yeah but you, were you going to say something? Yeah, um, it's, it's got... A question here, was God there for all the uh, great leaders that were assassined? Hmm. Assassined or assassinated? Assassinated. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's a good point because 
let's say, for example, the Pope. The Pope is supposed to be the holiest of the holiest. Yeah, yeah he's an intercessor yeah. or the connector between God mm. and the people on the planet. Yet, he drives around in a bulletproof Pope mobile. Pope mobile mm. with glass and everything. Bulletproof. bulletproof. Nah, nah, like, <laughs> and then they teach you if you die, especially if you're the Pope, you're going to heaven. Direct pass. Like. So, <laughs> why wouldn't you want to go? And meet mm. and be with God. This goes to show you that they will teach you one thing. Because if God helps his own, he should definitely help the Pope. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Right. Or is that another one of those things that makes you go, hmm, because why does the Pope need security? Yeah. And a bulletproof. Bulletproof. That's, that's the thing. Yeah. Because obviously, in fact, let's look at it this way. Jesus as well was here and he was... Um, Scared that he was going to be crucified on the cross. Yeah. And, um, but why though? Because the whole purpose of him coming was to die on the cross. Mm. And he knew that before yeah. he came. So, what happened there? He should have been prepared. Yeah. So, does God help his own? Mm. Did God help him? He was sweating blood, apparently, according to the Bible. When he was praying to be, <laughs> to be saved, yeah? So that, so that means but but the thing is, <laughs> people say Jesus is God as well, at the same time. Mm. You can't be God, send yourself mm. to come and die for the sins of the world, go back to heaven and sit on the right hand side of yourself. That logic doesn't make any sense, you see. So he separated himself from him and the Father. And... Um, yeah, which God are we talking about? Because there are many gods. Um, we can go through every religion that we've kind of mentioned. Mm. Islam is the same thing. Like, why would the prophet be poisoned and killed by mere mortals if his God, Allah, where was he to help him? So this book really does ask the question, does God help his own? And um, back to, um, does God help his own? The people that done the Hajj, the Muslims. Mm, yeah. How many people died last year? Mm. Trampled. And then how many people died this year? Yeah. So where was Allah to protect those Muslims? That were, this is supposed to be a holy land, but people got crushed and trampled on. Mm. Where was Allah? Yeah, I mean, this is a very good question because... What it is, there's a misconception mm. of who and what God really is. We've been explaining to people that the gods you're talking about are extraterrestrials that make mistakes, yeah. that parade around and do magic tricks and they hurt people when they don't get their way or they save those people that are doing their work mm. and they reward certain people and not others. So this scroll goes into that in detail about who these extraterrestrials are and how you want to get help is when you connect to your gods, your ancestors, your people that actually have an interest in helping you achieve what you want to achieve. And there are ways to do that, you know, and this is what Wusabat is here to teach you, how to connect with your ancestors who can help you from the other side as well as this side, but really you are the God, yeah, that has to do the work and then you will receive the help to get you to get whatever success you want to happen. Um, and you get, you get your powers back as a God as well. So you start to learn about your psychic abilities, you know, your healing abilities, mm -hmm. your abilities to communicate telepathically for distance. You can heal people from another country you know you can start to learn about how to open your third eye how to meditate how to elevate in terms of even lev to you know levitation mm. um there's just so much you learn when you enhance your abilities as the god you're the god or goddess yeah so read this scroll get it today um 
we, we don't have that many copies left actually yeah. of this, so get your copy. You can read this quite quickly within a couple of hours, but it's going to blow your mind and open up your whole concept of what you think God is. Anything else you want to say on that one? Compact with information. As little as this may seem, as small as it may seem, it's compact with a lot of, lot of affirmation. Yep. Okay. Does God help his own? Does he help you? If not, find out why. Mm.